here in Ann Arbor with the big man on campus, Chase Winovich. The Wolverines getting ready for Wisconsin, and you got to have a breakfast of champions first, right, Chase? Right. So for me, it's coming to Benny's. Typically, that's usually uh, my routine just throughout the week. Do your parents always come with you to Benny's in the morning? <laughs> hey, mom. Hey, dad. Hey, guys. <laughs> Walk me through your journey here at Michigan. So I came here and I was an inside backer. I was probably like um, 210 pounds, 215. I remember just before my last workout against Ohio State my freshman year, um, like right before the game, I, I, the coach wouldn't let me lift unless I weighed 200. <laughs> so he went, So I literally was like drinking waters. Like, like I think I drank like eight or nine bottles and uh, was just like throwing up like because I was just like so light. Um, and then I, I knew like after that I had to like, you know, start making a switch and they switched me to tight end. I presented the idea like of me going back to defense and Coach Madison was pretty excited about it. He was messing, saying, messing with me saying he wanted me the whole time, you know, and I was, I was a little skeptical of that. I was like, you just let me go. Like the first play I was out there, it was, a, you know, December. Mm -hmm. um, it was just like, I'm home again. It's Winovich who got there first again. Chase Winovich has had a whale of a game today. I say the name Connor McGregor. What's the first thing that comes to mind? He's the guy. Outside of my own family, like I just feel like every word that you know he, he speaks and everything, like it just. It's like, almost like he's saying it to me. Uh -huh. That's just like the- uh, He's like the, your spirit animal. He really is. <laughs> if, if there was such a thing for a human, yeah, he, he would be it. Okay, so you guys have been on so many European trips. I just want you to know that you're more well-traveled than me and you're probably, what, 23 <laughs> or something like that? Yeah. And I appreciate that about your life. What's it been like to experience different countries with your teammates? It was an emotional experience in, in Normandy. I, I'd say that would be, you know, tied for number one, if, you know, if, if not. On the way there, we watched Saving Private Ryan. Yeah. And just like actually being able to see like where everything went down and, and how it all went down, um, it was it was really cool. And seeing like just the, the vast number of graves too, like that these kids are you know are the same age as mine and they they made the ultimate sacrifice. There's there's none greater than you know giving your life, especially for your country. So it was, it was cool. Well, Chase, I gotta say the Chase Winovich is good, but the conversation with you here in this booth has been even better. Thanks, Chase. Here, cheers. 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 <laughs>